I love Minecraft gravity. I uh, say, comrades, I know. I can have floating chests in these things. Look at that, a chest in the air, and we can still access it. I'm gonna leave it like that. It pleases me greatly to have a floating chest. Oh, good, more cobblestone. Oh, hey! I wonder, can I dig that? Uh, it's, uh, huh. Now, what is this block? I've seen it before, and I cannot pick it up because I have too many dirt blocks or something like that. Uh, yeah! Okay, good. Now I can collect those. And I can also view what it is. Iron ore. Fantastic! I believe iron ore can be smelted down and then I can use it for something. I can actually smelt it into iron on the fire, which is great because I've got coal and charcoal and all these things from the wood. Which is excellent advice, guys. Thank you very much for posting that. Very much you helped me out. Eh, I don't care. I left a little pocket. I doubt anything will come out of it. Uh, yes, but... Oh, wow, this house is looking bigger and better all the time. And our chicken friend is just chilling out. You know what? I actually... Let's keep him in a cage. Let's have a pet chicken. He left us an egg. Oh, crap. Maybe I shouldn't have my chests all the way up there without a floor. Yeah. You laughing at me, chicken? Do you want to be fried? I don't have any oil on... Well, hold on. Let his where's axe? Let us use up this axe first. And then we will use this one. Okay, so coal, charcoal, coal, charcoal. Now, I guess I could put charcoal on the fire, right? Let me see. Aha, you can! <laughs> it's so funny! You use charcoal to make more charcoal out of this. It is like a perpetual system. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let us use up this almost dead axe. And that was something that I tried to say in my other episode of Minecraft, but was rudely interrupted by a pig who wanted to be slaughtered. Uh, if you look at the bottom of the screen where I have all my items that I select and you can do that by pressing the number buttons the numbers on your keypad or whatever you have on your computer uh, yes you press those and you'll see they have life bar well it, it has actual health so once your health is gone out of that you simply cannot use that item anymore and you have to go create more and look he makes more eggs I really don't know what you're supposed to do with them, but, uh... Come here, chicken. Okay, we can keep him in cage like this. Yes, I hear you over there. Let us see. We pro probably want to put that there. Now we have to lead him over there. Come on, chicken. Get in there. You can do it. I believe in you. Hey, hey, what are you doing? No! An escape! You son of a bitch! Get back in here! The creepers are out. Fine, you want to explode? What a dick. Completely wasted my glass. That's what I think of your face, chicken. Now you will die. You try to run away from Vladimir. You will be slaughtered. Oh look, you're dropping eggs all over the place. Why can you not just come back into my house? Why? And why was I so stupid to create your cage right by the fucking window that has no glass in it? I don't know. That was my own doing. Get in the house. Go. Go. Come on. Alright, you're being very annoying right now. And now you will have to pay with your feathers. I can't even hit you. And no feathers were dropped, you stupid chicken. Or were you my chicken? I don't even know. You all look alike. There's no variation on chickens in this game. But I have noticed there are variations of sheep. I've seen black sheep before in my other Minecraft levels. 
Okay, so now it is daytime again. We can keep working on the roof. I am sorry, comrades, that it starts out so slow in the Minecraft world. But as I said, it is evolution. It is a game of evolution. You start out very small and then you keep building until you can really just go out into the world and explore fearlessly without worry of predators attacking you because you've got the proper materials. That is how we all evolved. I mean, that is how we are here today. We started out as people in the cave, cave men's and women's, going outside with pointy sticks sometimes to hunt the pigs, which uh, back in the day, I guess, would be wild boars. Uh, you know, we start out that way, and then as we build more and we get safer houses and we get security of community, we go out further into the world. And uh, as Minecraft, it really, really epitomizes evolution. I think it's very cool. It's not a reason I'd love to talk about this game too much in person with, because uh, I, I'm wondering, you know, what, uh, what were some of the thoughts that were going through his head creating this game, you know? What was his inspiration? Did evolution ever come across in his mind that, huh, I wonder, you know, what happens if I create a game in which I simulate what the first humans interaction with the world was like, eh? I don't know. It looks like I am just uncovering more of that secret passageway. As a matter of fact, I am. Wait a second, this is not a secret passageway. Really? That's it? Yes, that was it. Look at that. That scary noise that we heard. All it was was this fucking thing. Look at this. It's just a cave. It's just a complete that's a nice... Huh, you know what, I will keep this tunnel. Oh, and there's coal right here. Fantastic! Lots of coal, lots of coal! It's good for me. Oh, yes, I love that. When there is coal, there is always more coal. I can't say that I've ever found one isolated area that has only one single coal block and nothing else, you know? It always seems to be that there are multiple coal blocks in the area when you dig one block away. So I guess this little passageway was very worth finding. And I'm gonna keep it as a secret exit way. Just in case there is a zombie apocalypse right outside Vladimir's house and I need to escape really quickly. And I don't have the proper weaponry, but still, I thought this was gonna be a, a labyrinth or something within my home. Yeah, it's kind of disappointing, but not really. Oh well, back to building the roof. Do, 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 do. Okay, keep going on this. Wow, I really have to do some mining, don't I? Yes, my house is just getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Expansion, expansion. I wish expansion in the real world was this harmless and this fun to do. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I should drink water more often, you know? talking for long periods of time. I tell you what, this is still from the original recording that uh, you're viewing. I did not even stop to take break and uh, go do something else. I am just still playing Minecraft. That's one thing this game definitely does well. It is very addictive, you know, you start mining away and mining away, your house slowly expands and then you get ideas in your head like, hey, now that my house is significantly large, Let's go out and build some crazy shit, eh? Let's see, how slow is it with the pickaxe? It's not too slow. I can, I can tolerate that. Awesome. So, you know, we have glass with us, and I said that... Actually, I didn't... Maybe I said it, I don't even remember. If I said it in this episode, or past episodes, or I said it on an episode that I never got out to the public because I was too stupid, to recognize that it was not recording when it should have been uh, but what I want to do is that lake over there I would like to try and create an underwater house and uh, the way I will do that is that there will be glass so you can see the water on top uh, but we need more glass but for now I would like a nice skylight and we only have seven pieces of wood we're gonna have to go out and X some trees for wood Okay, I hope I have enough wood to just finish this off at least. Uh, <laughs> at least in my Minecraft box, my storage box. Let's go take a look. 
Ah, fuck you. Yeah, I call shenanigans. Oh, crap. We really don't have much wood. All right, all right. Uh, well, we have a lot of cobblestone. I will patch this up for now. With cobblestone. And we'll mine this rest of this stuff away when it is nighttime, because right now it's looking pretty ugly, yes. But... Let's see, what should we do with this? We're gonna probably... Yeah, that's, that'll work. I'm just going to temporarily seal this off for now. So it is not a secret passageway for creepers at night, or skeletons, or spiders, whatever, to come into my home. And now we will just finish the roof with some cobblestone. I'll come back probably and redo it with wood later, but uh, for now, this will be good. This will look very nice, comrades. Ah, actually, right up there, okay. I don't want to take any chances of any creepers getting a possibility to get in my home. Okay, just making sure. Yeah, so we'll dig away more of this stuff when it is night time. But what I would like to do, if I could just go fast enough, is to get more wood from the trees. And that was something that was cut out of the original, uh, well, not original, just the recording. I forgot to set the sound properties to, to the right audio device. Uh, but yeah, I chopped a bunch of wooden resources, and that is why I had all these wood blocks in the first place. But now we have to go out for more wood. And we take our trusty rock axe, and we shall go. Now let me see, now that we're exploring the world, you keep toggling through the F button to uh, turn on and off the fog. This is with no fog, and this is a sheep that is giving us all its wool. You can't do anything else with the sheep but get wool from it, so even if you decide to destroy itself, it's not gonna give you lamb kebabs, if you're into that. I can't pick up the wool? What is this bullshit? You can only have eight wool at a time? Fine, fine, I just want wood. Or do I? No, I don't. I don't want wood right now. I want to go to my house before it becomes nighttime. Okay, so I guess we can do some of that mining that I said we were going to do right now. We'll mine some, uh, or not mine, but axe some trees for their wood later. Hehe, <laughs> axe. As in ask. <laughs> There's always humorous people who talk like that. Hey, let me ask you a question. Eh? It's usually guys from Jersey, you know. It's where Diogens is located, so it's where our main base of operations is for now. But uh, yeah, you get a lot of guys in New Jersey like that. They say, hey, let me ask you a question. Oh, really? Well, do you mind if I chainsaw your face? What? That is usually what the, the response is. And it's uh, more or less a what from my accent. They say, Yo, are you really Russian? I say, of course I'm fucking Russian, yeah? Are you really that much of an asshole? And they say, I don't know what you mean. And uh, that is usually when I disband the conversation. Because it's not worth talking to those peoples for too long. It would, uh, how you say, lower your IQ points by too many. So I think I'm going to finish up uh, moving in kind of deconstructing my house so it is all a larger area and then I will call this recording a wrap and uh, not that it matters to you guys because you're viewing it all as episode by episode but depending upon how long I recorded that will uh, very greatly vary on how many episodes you guys will be seeing at a time I know you people love Minecraft so you're probably going to say post as many videos as you can Vladimir and to that I very thank you much for uh, wanting so much Minecraft from me. You know, this is a good game, I, I will admit this. Hopefully my commentary has something to do with your enjoyment on the game as well. Um, but if you want to very much help me out, just be sure to comment below, uh, push the like button, that's very important, and also favorite, you know, and subscribe too. I know it sounds like a lot of things to do, but it is merely just clicks, clicks, clicks. Just click this, click that, and boom. 
You've got yourself liking my stuff. Oh, that is no good. We cannot have a hole. 